Happy Friday, everybody. We made it to the weekend, another great weekend. I am burning some white prairie sage, which is wrapped around a red and white twine. And I did a big deep dive last night into uh, the Gilgo Beach rabbit hole. And I just feel like I need something for a little bit of extra cleansing. And why not do that together? Let's call upon St. Germain, Lady Portia, the Violet Flame, Archangel Michael, who's the protector. Let's call upon Archangel Raphael, who gives all of the healing. Gabriel for the message. Message? Messenger? Given the messages. I need the sage, y'all. Imagine this is filling your aura field right now, pushing out the negativity. And whenever you light sage indoors <clears throat> or incense, you always want to have a door or window open. I have the bathroom open next to me uh, to rid the energy out. Uriel for justice and knowledge. The reading for the weekend. Transformation. Ooh. When this card appears, angels are acknowledging the emotional and physical transformation that has taken place in your life. They can see you more clearly now and that you have been released of the old and fuzzy thoughts and situations. There is a feeling of renewal now and you are moving into a space where you are more comfortable than ever with who you are. You are a spark of splendor burning in the depths of the being, and this spark is creating positive and loving experience for you now. It's time to enjoy the benefits of your commitment to growth. sacred plan. If you are trying to force a plan into action, the angelic guidance is on it to back down and trust in the greater good. Often when something isn't happening for us, we're frustrated, but it's only because we don't see it as our perfect plan that is unfolding. When your ideas or plans go wrong, trust that the universe has a greater plan for you do and the greater the plan isn't something that you're ready to be chosen for at this time more of a more of a culmination of all of your life intentions prayers and actions washing back towards you with the opportunity and experiences call on your angels to light up the path ahead you may feel that you are facing the unknown but know that you are always being guided and protected And because they really want you to know you are being guided and protected. Your guardian angels, baby. You are an independent soul and often found yourself trying to do everything on your own. But know that even just a quick prayer to your guardian angel can take away some of that pressure. Your angel wants to hear from you more. And in order to support you fully, they must be invited to do so. But when no request is too much but no request is too much your angel guide is <clears throat> your angel guide was made for you and is dedicated to you take the time for an easy and informal conversation with them speak openly and in a heartfelt way about your life any challenges that you are facing and anything you need help with through that conversation their help will find its way to you when you draw this card, they really want to know, they really want you to know that they are with you. 
that doesn't wrap it up with a bow for your weekend. I don't have anything else for you. See you on Monday. Bye.